Hello everyone, it's Rick from ToonTrack, and I'm here today to talk to you about our brand new Easy Keys library, The Small Upright. One of the things we continue to try and do with the Easy Keys line is bring you exciting and inspiring new instruments to help you make your musical ideas come to life quicker. And the small upright is no exception. The reality of this product is that you don't have to take just a normal piano library, maybe a piano library that came with your DAW or something you got online for free, and apply a bunch of different effects and a bunch of different processing to it to get something unique and interesting. Right out of the box, the very nature of this instrument is already unique and interesting. When these piano libraries are recorded, ToonTrack works with the best of the best in the recording industry to ensure that we're delivering the best sounding libraries that can humanly be attained through modern technology. Creating a, a software tool as powerful, flexible, and convenient as Easy Keys isn't enough. Inside that environment, we want our users, we want people that use the software to have as many options as possible sonically. And the more options you have available to you, the more sonic ideas you can come up with with the most minimal amount of technical expertise we always find to be the best when writing music. One of the reasons that ToonTrack continues to go and find unique and, we hope, exciting piano instruments to record is because we realize how similar the piano and drums actually are. And just like a drum shell, the drum head, and the tuning all affect the way the drum sounds, especially in relation to the room or the studio, the same is true with pianos. So one of the things that delineates a small upright from a normal upright, we'll call it, would obviously be the size, but how that size responds to the actual tonal characteristics. With the small upright, you're working at a much different sort of length of string, so you're getting higher pitch tones. So to have an instrument whose primary purpose sonically is already sort of predefined to pull itself out of a really dense mix is a very, very, very cool prospect for any writer or producer. So when you look at the scope of tools, in easy keys, and then you start to add really unique libraries with really unique stories like the small upright, what you have is sort of ground zero for an amazing opportunity to not only harness some inspiration you might not have had otherwise, but to take an idea and run with it with as little technical prowess or technical obstruction, if you will, as possible. <laughs> 